ओम शांति वेलकम यू हैव विद 24th ऑफ अगस्त व्हाट इज सेइंग बीइंग अ लार्ज हार्टेड और अ जेनरस हार्टेड पर्सन वी जनरली थिंक दैट बीइंग जेनरस हार्टेड मींस दैट यू गिविंग मनी टू समबडी और यू हेल्पिंग समबडी थ्रू बाइंग थिंग्स फॉर देम और यू हेल्पिंग देम व्हेन दे डोंट हैव मनी और यू हेल्पिंग देम व्हेन दे नीड समथिंग इन योर लाइफ सो यू आर हेल्पिंग देम आउट राइट बट द ट्रू हेल्प व्हिच इज गोइंग टू बी एवरलास्टिंग इज समथिंग एल्स व्हिच वी आर गोइंग टू एक्सप्लोर इन दिस टुडेस ब्लेसिंग गॉड सेज मे यू बी अ जेनरस हार्टेड and by having an a lockic exchange lockic exchange means you giving things around buying gifts and all uh, giving presents and all and uh, taking care of others and you know buying food taking them out for dinner that is lockic so god says what about a lockic exchange what is a lockic a lockic means something which is spiritual exchange which can only be not of things but can only be of your values your virtues your qualities showing patience in terms of uh, when they they struggle showing tolerance showing humility showing uh, reverence towards god removing confusion helping others to come out of uh, confusion and depression many other things that is a lockic exchange of giving and take become full of all specialities when you go to a mela you give some money and receive something in return right that's what we do whether it's a mela whether it's a shop you first give money then you get something before you receive anything you have to give something so to in the spiritual mela in this physical world where we all are spirits actually you take something from the father or from someone else that is you imbibe it yourself either we are throughout the day thinking about somebody's negativity focusing on the negativity talking about the negativity and we are taking it it's like a virus entering our mind and that's what we do when we see that person we have thought so much negative about them that we speak out that negative to them you are like this you have done this you have spoiled this so what says that is not an allocic exchange when you imbibe a virtue or a speciality ordinary ordinariness finishes the ordinary behaviors finish when we are imbibing speciality we don't react like everybody else we don't talk like everybody else we don't get agitated like everybody else that's like ordinary ordinary people do that by imbibing virtues your weakness automatically finishes so when other people are showing impatience you are showing patience that is they are showing ordinary impatience the kaluk is ordinary so they want to show impatience when they are showing uh, ego you are showing humility and that's what god says that is being special this becomes a form of giving that means you are able to give them patience you are able to give them showcase them how humility is being shown be generous at every second in this give and take and you will become full of all specialities be generous people are like if you don't have enough money then you can control that okay i won't be able to give so much but when you are able to exchange qualities and virtues they are endless how much is humility can you wait can you measure it no so keep on giving out humility when other people are showing ego keep on giving out uh, purity when other people are showing impurity keep on giving out uh, virtues qualities like discipline patience tolerance and when other people are showing opposite that is what god says being fractal or being generous hearted Give just give them these qualities through your actions, and that's what we learn in Brahma Kumaris. I'm sure they do this.